I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a pumpkin belly Thanksgiving turkey. I take two fingers at the top in the center and I put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a little curve line down on the right, straight line down, and leave it floating. Come back to the dot. I'm going to draw a little curve line down, straight line down, and leave it floating. Right here where I stop, I do a straight diagonal down, straight diagonal up, connect. Okay? Come over here on the left hand side and we're going to draw a curve line down, straight diagonal up, connect, little curve line underneath. Right here at this point we draw a curve line down one, curve line down two. I come right up to this point and I just draw a curve line down, curve line up, connect. Right here I put one, two little dots. Right here I put one dot. Starting right here at this point I draw a curve line out, down, and over. Leave it floating. Come back to the right, draw a curve line out down and connect. Right here on the left I draw a straight line down and a triangle. Straight line, straight line, straight line, connect. Right next to it, straight line down, triangle, straight line, straight line, straight line, connect. I come right here inside and I draw a curve line, curve line, Curve line down on the left, curve line, curve line, curve line down on the right. Starting right over here, I'm going to draw a big curve line all the way around and down, connect. And over here on the right, I draw one, two, three curve lines connect and on the left I draw one, two, three curve lines connect. Okay? I think that's all. We are ready to color. Okay, since I call this a pumpkin belly turkey for Thanksgiving, I'm going to color his tummy orange because this is the pumpkin part. So you color this section orange like you would a pumpkin and since I have my orange crayon out I'm going to color my little triangle shapes down here at the bottom also orange. Okay? Next I take a brown and I'm going to color this space brown and you might want to do it a little bit lightly because you don't want to lose all of your details that you drew. So I'm going to do this light brown. And then I'm going to do this space on the right brown and this space on the left brown because it's symmetrical. Whatever I color on the left, I want to color again on the right. This is for his tail. Next, I take red and I'm going to color this little part by his nose, his beak I should say, and this is his waddle. This should be red. And then I'm going to color these on the right and on the left. I'm going to color these red also. Okay? Whoops, and I forgot a part as I always do. Take your orange and do his beak. Do his beak orange. Okay, next I take a yellow and I'm going to color the big space behind him yellow. This is going to kind of let him pop a little bit his face. And then I come down and I do these last spaces on the right and on the left. Okay, then as always 
I always like to add a pop of color in the background. Now you can always draw something else in the background. You don't have to do green lines. You can do something else. Floating pieces of pumpkin pie. Ears of corn. You're the artist. You make the decision. Okay? You'll do a better job than me on coloring. Alright, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here is my pumpkin belly turkey for Thanksgiving all colored in. Okay, bye-bye.